Howdy folks, I'm Ben Clark, welcome to Clark's Customs Garage. Uh, today I've just had another car come in for some rust repairs and we'll go check it out. So it's a yellow XD Falcon, Ute, uh, 1979. So, excuse me, sorry, dog's wandering off. Shop inspectors come to have a look. So, we've come in for repairs on this lower quarter. As you can see, we've got rust in this end. I've just pulled all the paint off to have a, a bit of a hunt around. Uh, this end looked okay at first. There's a little bit, uh, some holes starting to form in the top seal there. So, I'm gonna have to get back in there, fix all the way along there. Up here, around the quarter windows. Bom bom. As you can see, we've got quite a large hole here. This was, is it still in here? Yeah, so, I don't know if you can see that, but basically that's what's left of the aluminium tape that they use to tape over it and just fill it with filler. As many people did back in the day. Uh, fronts of the pillars, the, there's been a lot of work done on this car, it's, it almost feels like it was a panel van chopped in to a ute. I'll show you that up the back later, but there's more crud in the front of these seals and for some reason they've all been overlaid. This is not factory welding, to my knowledge. Um, well, maybe it is, but it's a pretty bad job if it is. Uh, coming around the front, We've got a piece down inside the radiator surround here, which goes right through, as you can see the light through the back of it. Up along the top of the plenum, it's just starting to go in here. Uh, I'll be repairing those ones from the outside and, uh, and leaving this car. This is a get back on the road and driver car, so we won't be pulling the plenum apart, not for that little bit. Um, down here, it's had a big old patch and a heap of crazy stuff going on where it's sort of beaten up and filled up with weld and bits of plate tacked over the top of it. Nothing's properly welded. You can see this is all rusted out as well. And you can sort of, I don't know if you can make out how thin that is from that noise, but it's wafer thin. So, um, there's another patch going up into here somewhere which I have to grind out a bit more. That's its seam running up there and on here. So all that's going to have to be cut out, essentially, and a new piece made for there. And as it comes down through here, it's all gone through as well and welded into and just a mess. Uh, there's a small piece back here on the top of the seal. Then again, this quarter front and rear corner back up here again in the quarter window this time we've got rust holes in the front as well as up in here again it was taped in it's dropped in um, there's a piece under the floor and the owner tells me he would like the uh, the LPG filler cap removed and plate it over. So that's this one for now. Um, as I said, we're not going to dig too deep into it. I'm going to do patch panels on all these sections. Um, it's actually come to me from the paint shop. It was taken in there to be painted and as they sort of opened it up, they just found more and more. So uh, yeah, and of course they've, you can see here the it's probably the original colour and then this is the colour it's gone over it and it's just all started peeling off too. It's coming up in sheets. So, yeah. All right. So that's where we're at with the XD. I think I got it all. Oh, there is a piece under the floor as well. Um, oh, I can get in there. Now I'm lying down. Um, where was it? It's sort of up in there. We might be able to see it better on the camera. 
yeah so you can see there's a bit of filler and a bit of something going on there so i'll clean that out and um check it out so xd falcon i'll spin you back around we can't do it there you go folks so i'll give you a bit of an update when i get into it thanks for watching